problems in urban police departments are not always found in fiction. Our next Peabody Award winner, Evidence of Errors, uncovered massive problems in the Houston, Texas crime lab, which led to policy changes all across the state. Sutton's lawyer had bad news on his test results. He said, well, your DNA is positive. And uh, I was like, how, I mean, how possible? I, ain't no way. It's impossible. And so a jury found Josiah Sutton guilty and sentenced him to 25 years. But Sutton still insists. Something's wrong. And now it turns out he may be right. As I look over the test results in a case like this, I think this is ridiculous. Bill Thompson is a nationally known DNA evidence expert from California who's been reviewing cases from the HPD crime lab at our request. The quality of the work here is, in this lab is just grossly inadequate. So we gave him Sutton's trial transcript and the lab's test work, and he says... Well, I think that we have a, a clear miscarriage of justice here. Here to accept the Peabody Award is David Razik, investigative producer for KHOU-TV in Houston. Well, I'm happy to say that as a result of our investigation, that young man you saw, Josiah Sutton, was freed about a month after that program. Thank you. And just this Friday, he was finally pardoned by the governor of Texas as an innocent man. The, Hu the Houston DNA crime lab was shut down, and hundreds of other cases are being retested uh, to search for other errors. And indeed, appear there, there does appear to have been more. However, there are probably many more Josiahs sitting in prisons across the country. Why? Because few states check on the work of these labs, and neither does the federal government. In fact, dog food labs must pass a yearly federal inspection to, to remain open, but there is no such program for crime labs. My partners Anna Werner and Chris Hanau and I would like to thank first the Peabody Board for this kind honor, and we'd also like to thank our KHOU News Director Mike Devlin, General Manager Peter Diaz, and of course, the Belo Corporation for encouraging and nurturing our work. Thank you. <laughs>